and today we are going to be doing another long division division video with me. Okay, so first we have to ask ourselves, does five go into seven? And this time it actually does. So what times five can get us closer to seven? And that is one. So we do seven minus five. And that equals two. Then we're going to bring down our 8. Sorry about my sloppy handwriting. Um, so we have 28. Now what times 5 can get us closest to 28? That would probably be 5 times 5. And that is 25. And if you notice how I have a 1 and a 5 up on top, I'm actually creating our answer while we do this. So this whole bottom part doesn't matter. Only the top actually matters. So yeah, I'm going to have to erase that though. I'm just going to put another 15 that we have so far. Okay, so then we do 28 minus 25. So 8 minus 5 equals 3. And then 2 minus 2 equals 0. And then we're going to bring down our 5, and it's going to be 35. 35. I'm going to erase this. So I'm going to put 8 times 35. And then we do what times 5 can get us closest to 35, or the exact same as 35, and that would be 7. And then we do 35 minus 35 equals 0. So our answer is 157. Hope you liked my video. Goodbye.